Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Norik. Welcome back to the final episode of Fall Guys Season 6. The final round of the Satellite Stars Challenges has gone live. And it's based on Sweet Thieves. Um, I have actually technically already recorded a full video on this. But my teammates were so bad I lost every conceivable game. And none of the footage was inherently that entertaining. I mean, except the part where I ate raw G fuel powder. That was... That was fun. But, um, yeah, no, you know, I'm, I'm perked up. I just got finished recording the, uh, the thing. Um, whatever you'd call it. I'm AC and L, so I'm, I'm definitely in the recording mood, all warmed up. All we need, all we need now, and I dare to say it, is, uh, some actually good content, and we have a usable video. If the game would like to provide it with me. Um, so yeah. We have already done a few of the challenges, but ideally, this is gonna be the best show if matchmaking would be so kind as to give me some decent teammates. Anyway, so what we're playing with here, I can press Alt to go invisible. That's why the round is called Invisi Beans, I do believe. But let's just walk. Let's just play it like, you know, horrifically safe, honestly. And I don't like that already. So. Woo! Okay, I, I got it away from him. Although there is five out of eight of us in the thing. Like, I, was, I was sorry I went quiet there. I was concentrating. Um, now can any of my teammates concentrate? And they're already camping the button. This is... See, I, I said this in the scrapped recording, but like the Guardians really have figured out like the optimal strategy in um, how to win. And considering a lot of people are using this mode to like, farm wins, which make, makes sense. Like also, especially like grinding it to get infallible. It's not the most fun um, when you have a game like this. And I think, I think, um, yeah, we'll use this game as the, um, de facto example as for why the last recording was scrapped. Like, all I want him to do more than anything is just get on there, free us, and get away himself. Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go. This is that good shit trademark. So, get that in if I can. And that should boost morale, like, a tiny little, you know, like, specimen of a bit. Okay, and for some reason that guy just let me walk the fuck away. That's normal. Um, okay, and he's approach- he approaches! I de-approach. And you can't grab me? Sayonara! Okay, okay. I'm just gonna- we're gonna take a sec to regroup. Everybody's been refreed. Okay. Okay. This- this all of a sudden got a lot more interesting. Because it did. Oh, it's me! It's your arch nemesis, the Bulliat Man. They, they call me the Bulliat Man because I'm Russian. It's actually rather mean. I would wish they stopped calling me by that, but you know how it goes. Either way, three out of seven, somebody's disconnected. A joy. But, um, right, this should bring us up to five. If anybody else is bringing out else, that uh, works for me. But I think we may be able to win if solely off the merits of, um, these guardians kind of suck for just camping the button, considering there's. Oh, there's two people left out. Yeah, that's, um, alarming. Okay. Um, I'm not sure what I was thinking about. I was thinking I could do, like, some phase trick shot onto the button. Not whatever that ended up being. Um. Oh, look, one of us is disconnected. I. Are you. Are you AFK? You are everything wrong with this mode. You're just AFK and trying to farm crown shards because you know there's a chance your team might carry you. Oh, there's some people that just stand there and spam emotes so they don't get AFK kicked. But it's like. Man. Is this fun? Is this anyone's definition of fun? So this isn't my definition of fun. Like, I, I hear Media Tonic are trying to work on, like, the whole AFK situation in this mode, but... Realistically, they should have thought of themselves. It's a one-round mode, but, like, there's a high enough chance you'll win if you just AFK. I, I, I don't know. I'm gonna get my gripes out now. They should they should have accounted for that and then patched that out or, like, made, made a system to remedy it as much as possible before launching the round mode the first time. More so over the second time, they should have known what was coming and, you know... Prepared. Well, you know, it's just a theory, game theory. What do I know about game design? Or common sense? I have neither of those skills. Never will, so the kids say. Um, anyway, so hold over from the last bit of this recording I did. Um, yeah, some random part of my G Fuel contain. You know, it's like. I'm not sure, it's like. Somehow there's like a bit of power that's fallen through and gotten stuck under the sticker. And I'm not sure how. There's like, like if you feel. If you like hover your hand over it, it's like a bumpy, and it's like. Part of last episode, I just tried digging a bit of a USB cable in to, like, de-scrape it, because I think it's powder, still. Maybe it won't be, I don't, I don't, either way. 
Uh, that substance does look kind of hazardous, NGL. Could probably sell it to some random guy on the street corner for a few thousand. Um, anyway, but right, before I um, permanently ruin uh, my Wi Fi adapter for if and when my LAN cable fails me, let's, um, let's go. Okay. This game we're gonna win. After all, I've been in close proximity of a G Fuel thing now. Anything is possible. I'm gonna feel the vibes and then, and then, I'm gonna touch the sky. See ya. Bye, bitch. Dog gif. Okay, so what we got here typical 1 2 1 2 maneuver. I'm being chased. He's the chaser. I'm Bradley Walsh. Welcome to this evening's edition of The Chase. He. Oh, good lord, he's gonna grab me. No, he's not. <laughs> okay, uh, hello, compadre. Nice to meet you. And we leave. Okay, okay. Already, I do like to believe that the four guys sweep is in motion. This is... Oh, okay. Why disconnect? Why disconnect? Why ruin it for everybody else? There you go. Yeah, okay. Actually, you know, maybe running straight towards you was a bad idea. So I'm not going to do that anymore. I'm going to change my ways. I'm going to become a new man. Um, a new man. Renowned for his uh, his trickery. Oh, oh, sh shit. Somebody else take the sweet hair? Um, that was Norm Void. Um... Okay, right, fourth time around the charm, and he's still following me for what god known reason, I cannot tell you. Aha, you think you could cut me off, but I'm going to cut you off. Okay, I'm not sure I was going with that sentence, but it went somewhere. And now we take the alternate route. And because nobody saw me going invisible, I should be fine. Just press it whenever I have a hunch somebody's following me. Right, three of us have been captured. Oh, yeah, yellow isn't my team color, is it? But I did score, so I mean, you yeah. know. Right, come on. Right, the button's only guarded by one person. There's a chance somebody could run straight on in and just bonk. Time will tell, time will tell. We also only need four sweets left, so it's who's going to risk it for a biscuit, realistically. Can these guys actively free us? I don't know. Oh! That was perhaps most like a sick trick shot I've ever seen. Oh my word. Okay, okay, okay. The numbers of people in prison are starting to increase slightly. But it doesn't matter. It does not matter one bit. I actually won a game. And I like to think I played an active part in uh, helping that be achieved. Fuck you, one person who disconnected. I made it, Mum. He didn't. He missed out on his win because he didn't believe in us. Uh, first win, and I've been here for like 25, 30 minutes. Feels good. Ah, <sighs> either way, um, so we actually uh, started doing my daily challenges, and we uh, we won some stuff. I'm not going to win how many times? How, how many? How, how many? How many? Ten, 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 ten wins. Not much sure I'm surprised at this point, but crikey! Right, okay. Three wins on Guardian, I can get what six is a thief, man. Have you seen the things I've like had to go through to get here? Man, it's like I've, I've fought entire wars in that single same arena. Oh. Oh, okay, well, it's fine. It's fine. We can survive. We can survive. I think. Maybe. Perhaps. Well, um, we'll figure it out as we go along, you know? Yes. Okay. Anyway, can I, if I could be Guardian, that actually would be good for... A, my win stats, and B, I am a thief. <laughs> can I get, if I can get at least one Guardian game out of this, I, I will be happy. I'll be happy. But, let's go again. Thieverous guys. Commence. Okay. So, how many of you are AFK? J just the one, okay. Well, you're really girl bossing it up in here, aren't you? And I have names on, I can see you, bitch. <laughs> oh, a little change in elevation, and all of a sudden your plans fall through. Yeah, you can chase me, and you can mold, but you can't win. You will never win. Not when you're playing against me. Because I simply employ a strategy for not allowing myself to lose. Whoa! <laughs> oh! Okay, okay. Being a public nuisance has its benefits, I assume. Anyway, we climb up the... Really? Really, three, three, okay, four, four of you disconnected. Four. Four. After seeing the trick shots I was pulling off on them, four of you thought, 
Hey, yeah, not, not, not for me, that. Um. You know, go ice cream, man. If you freeze, we maybe be able to get a single sweeten. Oh! Oh! And one of the guardians did that, somehow. Is he spamming it to, like, help us win? I... I don't know and I couldn't tell you. I have names on! It's like a feature in the game to see where people are, even when they're out of sight. I'm perhaps even out of mind. You can play the middle ground- oh, now I'm the last person alive. Hello, good sir, just put me out of my misery, please, I'm fucking begging you. Just seriously, it's like very simple, just grab me. Thank you. See, that, that's the problem with this mode. People have a minor hunch that they're gonna win. Disconnect and almost set that hunch in stone for everybody else. And it's like... Boss. Maybe if there was like a rare golden sweet that Drone like spawned that gave you four points, maybe maybe, maybe that like changed the tide. I don't, I don't know though. I don't know, but I particularly, I do not like the attitude all the people have developed to this because Again, it's one round show, so you've got the AFKers, the quitters who really don't care about the XP and the kudos you get for waiting around now. It's. Mm. Honestly, I'm. I, they definitely need to make some tweaks to how Sweet Thieves works. More so preventing people from disconnecting because. Mmm. I'm. I know my gust of that. Because it just, it, it's a fun round, it's just spoiled by. On say media tonics actions, but like its own design allows it to be exploited to be not fun. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's, that's a wise, wise set of words from a wise looking skip. Look, look, look at him, look, look at how wise he is, and look how long he's been falling for, Kevin. Okay, certainly, I'm getting cooked by matchmaking, so we're gonna queue up again! Four guys experience, fellas. <sighs> I really hope next season things improve, though. I'm aware that a lot more people are very much more... Yeah, a lot of people are more dissatisfied with the game than I am right now. Personally, I think it's just... Hmm, where, where update, media tonic, but... Yeah, no, I know a lot more people, if they see that they're getting stuck in matchmaking or getting cooked the way I am, they'd be losing it, like, live on stream right now, so... <laughs> yeah, I, I, mean, I like to think... If I, if I don't have much, I have patience. And another game to play as a thief, okay. Do your fucking thief stuff. It's like, seriously? Like, I understand it's like, you know, probabilities and all that, but like, man. And I mean this sincerely. You fucking suck. <laughs> Outphased. Okay, and they just ignore. Well. Wait, are those. Is there a member of the Guardians team which is actively pushing the button to let us out? I, um, and there's another one trying to grab him to stop him. And there's another one chasing me. I think we've got this win in the bag. Maybe those ten wins aren't so daunting after all when you get guardians that are like, <laughs> you equally hate the mode as much as your not regular teammates do. You thought you had me, but you were wrong. I can't be caught. I covered myself in oil while I was trying to learn how to fly. <laughs> Honestly, don't know. This game does weird things to uh, my thought process, and just generally by the end of it, it deteriorates a fair bit. But I see. I wonder why this guy's constantly jumping. Is he just, is he just like an earnest guy trying, to, like, you know, help the homies get some wins in? I don't know. What I do know though is that we're probably gonna win soon. No, I refuse to go to prison while someone's actively spamming the release button. Okay, yeah, to be fair, I would have been immediately released. So point stands. Um, but are you weak? Yeah, this is definitely a win. It doesn't feel like an earned win, but it feels like a win where I can easily point out the um, flaws this mode has. I think allowing Guardians to act as an accidentally press the button is funny, but I don't think it feels rewarding when they actively exploit our world. Rather of one of my own merits and a genuine mistake than that guy clearly just spamming it so we can win. Hmm. Yeah. Either way, oh, that is my daily challenges done for the day. And now all I would like to do is get some of my Guardian challenges done, because... To be fair, if we look at uh, the actual achievements, we got Bomb Heart for the outfit, we just need 200 more, so... Literally, if we play as a Guardian and grab a bunch of guys really well, we, um... We're pretty much off. Off to the races. Mm -hmm. And honestly, I think just winning a game as a Guardian, you know, it's a nice little send-off for Season 6. 
Like I said, I, I, would, I would do another video where I play just main show. Or maybe if they bring back, like, just the season six rounds in a show. Maybe that'd be a better send-off. But for what it's worth, I think Sweet Thieves is a nice send-off for this season. Especially because this is, like, the second video I've made on it, shockingly. It's like, oh, man, it's, I feel so old. I feel so old, and, like, I'm falling apart at the seams, and it's like... Man. Man. Mm, man. Either way, we've played three or four games at this point. Technically, I've played seven today as Thieves, and only one as Guardian. So, realistically, I should be a Guardian. Uh, but I'm not. Instead, I am disappointed. That's fine, though. Like I said, if we can have some exhilarating gameplay, I don't I, I don't mind. I more so just mind when I keep getting stuck as Thieves with horrific teammates. Because, my god, some of you are impressively bad. Like, I'm not sure how you managed to do it, but you do. Anyway, I'm up here now. So is he. Let's kill each other. Anyway, we grab that and we run. Just offload him to a different person. Easy enough. Anyway, take the diagonal around. Just gonna keep an eye out for any names I don't recognize as being part of my own team. And we got like the fact that you can enable names in this mode is basically just like enabling wall hacks to see where the guardians are at all times. Like this guy's taking it cautious because he doesn't know where the guardian is. I know there's no one fucking here. <laughs> so I play a little bit differently. It's like I'm not sure what exactly it is, but I love it. And this guy's definitely chasing me, so we're just gonna just gonna hold W. I'm not even gonna try out maneuver him. We're just gonna we're just gonna live. And look, man, I'm trying to like win us the game. I would appreciate if you are cooperation in a little bit, but I digress. Do you know we'll go to the other side? We'll go to the other side. We'll, we'll shake it up, and we'll even get flung over there too for cinematic effect. Anyway, hello, hello. Are you the guardian? You are. I make you go. R. D. M. I have been knocked over, and now I'm dead. I am. Hmm. Okay. I think yeah, they're guarding the button. Um, our chances of qualifying are very up in the air right now. Please don't get captured. Okay. The one of you really, really has to step up his game a bit. Not even that. You just have to win. Just hit the button. Push the button like it's a fucking Sugar Babes song. Oh, <gasps> And we're done. Okay, he was captured, but he's immediately going to be freed. <laughs> oh, that is what Sweet Thieves is all about. Okay, well, let's go then. Anybody older or older? Oh, and, oh my god, it's my hero. He's my hero. And I'm carrying another sweet. There's a high chance. There's a very high chance that that... Right there is going to win us the game. Okay, my attitude towards the round has increased as my, like, the matchmaking seems to bind itself out. Definitely a lot less AFK people now, and I'm kind of I'm enjoying the mode more. It feels like how it used to, where it's pretty easy to win. You just need a fair bit of skill on each tie, but it can still go either way regardless. So that makes our third Thief win, and zero with Guardian win still. So I think next game is going to be the last one. The question is, is it going to bless us as a game as Guardians, or, um, not? I don't know what I like for it to be. I think it'd be cool. You know, good called content, good advertisement to Media Tonic. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I have your interest now. I actually. If, if, that, if, that, if that honestly. If that honestly gets me a guardian, you know, I'll, I'll complain. Maybe, maybe I should, but. Maybe. Maybe. Alright, that words. I've talked too much. Like I said, I need to talk on one more video after this. This was only Persona 4, so I can vibe a bit, but. Ugh. Oh, whew. Man. Come on. I want to be that yellow guy, and not that invisible guy. Just once. Just once. I want to be a guardian. Pretty please, Media Tonic. Please? Please? Please load first, actually. Okay. Camera frozen. Turns out that dreams really don't come true, guys. That's fine. It's fine. I'm sure I'll have a streak of Guardian games at some point regardless, but still. I was looking forward to at least having a little bit of diversity in the content, but you know, it's fine. 
For what it's worth, ending season six was the game where I'm disappointed I don't get exactly what I want. Yeah, ending again, ending season six. Like, yeah, ending season six is a set of videos with a video, or oh, the final game where I, I express act of disappointment. Yeah, man, that's, that's, that's on brand. Anyway, wh why? You're, you're, you're aware that just actively harms the team, right? Especially if nobody's in there when you open it. Uh, come on. If, so if season six can't end like this, we at least need to have an interesting game. Can't just end it like waiting for stuff to happen. Oh, oh my gosh, you know, that's cinematic parallels, fellas. Hmm. Hmm. I really do hope that season seven is uh, better than this, though. Like I said, I think multi platform launch and going free to play are definitely a step in making the game a little bit more alive. Maybe it'll have a huge surging popularity. Maybe it will not. I, I don't know on the matter, but I can certainly hope so, because as much as I will rag on Mediatonic, the game's all right. And I think it means that um, all the mismanaging that may or may not have gone on behind the scenes is, um, you know, certainly not have like a devastating blow impact to a lot of other people like to make it out as having. So, hmm. Anyway, are these guys are actually starting to camp the button. Do you have another personality trait by chance? So just going the fuck outside or going the fuck outside or. <laughs> Still failing your job, despite the fact there's three of you on it. <laughs> oh, you're chasing a ghost that doesn't exist. They call me the ghost of Sushima. So I work in a sushi factory. I make it for the people at Tesco. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, he's ignoring everybody else and coming straight for me. Oh, the divine hatred, the last second fuck up, and me being the person to... Okay, it doesn't matter, you they still didn't catch me before we win. Nah. And I could make some cool analogy about how the game played out in reference to the game's future and current state, but I don't have the mental capacity for that. So that was Sweet Thieves and Bravery. We haven't completed all the challenges, but we most certainly have um, completed the season. Like I said, if um, the next season releases on the day I'm expecting it to, which is May 9th, which is literally four days away, I'll be rather happy uh, to meet you guys again for some more full Gus content. But until then, I think it's time to hang up the hat and say goodbye to season six. You're a season of kind of highs and then lows and then lows and then kind of highs, then more lows and more lows and a few crossovers here and there, but mostly lows. Um, so the fact I managed to make the most content out of you out of any other season does mildly concern me as to um, what exact type of game I'm drawn to to play on the channel, but we're not going to think on that now. So, thoughts said, all that side, I really hope you've enjoyed, and thanks for watching, guys. My name's Ben Ramek, peace out, and hopefully next time I see you, four guys will be in a little bit better of a state uh, than it was today.